Hello, it is once again time to do some baking. Um, since last time I've been gifted a, uh, a, a, a scale, so uh, you know, everything's gonna get a bit easier. These scales are making everything so much easier already. Thank you, Jamie, for these. They're, uh, they're fantastic. Now, I know I'm only supposed to use 140 grams of caster sugar, but the bowl weighs 660 grams. I've got my flowers and sugars and that all whisked up. I've got the milk and the eggs all whisked up. And I've kept the cocoa separate for now, because, of course, I'm going to try marbling with this one again. Um, time to mix it all. Right, there's all the chocolate mixed in, so obviously the, where I've been following the recipe and all that, this is slightly thicker and that's a bit more liquidy, but I'm sure it'll bake fine. Um, time to start adding my orange extract to this half. This orange honestly smells delicious. It's, it smells like the, um, the orange creams you get in Quality Street. There we go, the orange halves are in, and time to put in the chocolate and give it a little bit of a go around with one of these. There we go, they're ready to go into the oven. I'm not entirely sure how they're going to turn out, because yeah, the um, the chocolate section is actually thicker, because obviously I was just following a normal cupcake recipe, but it wouldn't be a baking video unless I made a mistake somewhere. I've just taken them out of the oven. These smell absolutely delicious. I just, I can't wait to try and eat them. Just need to uh, put them on the cooling tray right now. So I decided to try them while they're still warm, and they taste pretty good. I feel like maybe I've not quite added enough orange into it. Um, the orange is slightly bitter, but they, they taste really good. Yeah, the, the, the chocolate bit is a little bit thicker. Um, but yeah, these are really nice. 